Okay. I think we're back. And we're no longer flashing. Welcome back. Oh, everybody. <coughs> so, we've come back to the, uh, we've come to the end of the dual signings here, the live on-camera signings. The last recipient is Karina Pemberton. So Karina, you're the lucky last for today. Uh, if you didn't manage to get a live signing of the two of us on camera today, oh, it's gonna be a while. It'll be a while till we do that, probably next June or something like that. Um, but, uh, but anyway, but single ones, well, I'm sure we'll do another one, another session. Yeah, I mean, we could do them live without being together, but we, that would be hard, because, yeah, that's hard. Good, yeah. yeah. Doesn't really work like that, does it? We're in different locations. But if you don't want them signed on camera, we could definitely get two photos signed by each of us uh, off camera, and we'll get them to you. Might take an extra week or two, but anyway. Do you want me to cut this out on a plate? Mm -hmm. Do you want me to heat it up? Oh. Mm -hmm. No? Do you want well, it might else? melt. Let's go to chop it. Oh, oh. Do you want me to just chop it up on a plate? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. The solo photos, do we want to go one at a time or just hand to each of you as you go through your lists? Oh, gosh. Okay. Yeah, okay, so now we're gonna do single photos. Um, we can start with you, Martin, because you've got the majority of them. I think it's my list is, uh, my list is still on all the duels. Um, so you gotta change it to just you. Go up to the top and just press it. Uh, uh, oh, oh, we should really put this through there. Oh. Uh, okay, Yi, this is for Lit Yi. Uh, Yi Jia. Uh, oh, hello to the Lee sisters. I can do that. Hello to the Lee. Make sure I spell that right. L Y Lee. This did. Okay. With love. There we go. Kiss. Um. Thank you. All right, there's a little note for you, but I'm gonna keep that secret between you and I, Yi. Nothing like, nothing like that, nothing like that. Oh, oh my God, look at this. What's in here? Chocolate? 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 And hazelnuts. Oh. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, your scale's off here, we keep going. Okay! What is a... DJ! Please read, Pure Mountain, I love your work. Oh, I love it. Inspired me to buy a sailboat, and now I'm in the planning phases to sail the South Pacific. TJ, you have no idea how happy that makes me, the fact that Someone actually believed me when I explained that yeah. living on a sailboat is possibly the greatest way to experience this uh, earthly experience. So I am so happy for you, TJ. Um, so to TJ, TJ, stay inspired. 
Oh my goodness, that is such good advice. All right, TJ. I have one from um, from Kim here. Uh, I love Virgin River. I'm your biggest fan. You and Martin are the best. And what you do for the their fans is amazing. It's so great to uh, that you are doing this. Thank you. Made my day. Happy day. Happy day. Kim. That's for you, TJ. Happy sailing, safe sailing. Hope you have the best adventures ever. And I'll see you out there. I'm gonna be yeah. in the South Pacific probably in a, let's say a couple of years. I'm gonna have my boat there. So I'll see you in Tahiti. Mm. Okay, Olivia. I'm so jealous. Uh, you guys can come. Mm. Come and, you do the easy part, just fly in, fly out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the kids, your kids will be old enough then. My kids are much better at in a few years like a couple of years swimming now yeah I've been getting a pool so to Olivia oh yeah they're gonna be little water babies this one's for Debbie this is for you Debbie I know nothing about you there's no special instructions but that is for you and this is to Olivia hi Olivia from California um, she loves Virgin River, it's an escape, especially when things get stressful. She's in a teaching program. Wow, what a couple of years that must have been for you, eh? Well, congrats on getting through what I'm sure was chaotic and frustrating. Um, thank you for playing a part in that. Oh, I'm glad that we helped you get through a stressful time. Wish I could meet you at Jack's bar. I would love any personal note from you. Oh, let me write something on that. Okay, Olivia, let me write a little something. Um, this is for Diane, and Diane would like me to say excited for you to see season five. I am excited for you to see season five. I'm also, to be honest, I'm a little bit nervous about some of the fan reactions. A little nervous. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be an interesting season for y'all. It is an interesting season for everybody. Yeah. Um. There's a lot going on in season five, don't you think? Oh, so much. So many storylines, there's so many big events that take place. Do we have a spare one of those? I kind of screwed it up. Yep. Oh, sorry, Olivia, I got a bit, um, my blood sugar's getting low. Yeah, season five. Yeah, I anticipated your needs. Thank you. you. Look at me. Thank you. Season five is gonna be Really? It's gonna be new, there's a lot of newness. There's new characters, new relationship. A lot of ending, a lot of beginning. There's more action. Like it's, a, it's, it's gonna be in some ways quite different, but obviously it's gonna be the same show, but I think it's gonna offer more dimension to the characters and the storylines. You have plenty next? Okay, to Thank Olivia. You. Um, this is for Penny. I think this is, I think we signed a duo for Penny. Because she said the same thing here. She loved, loved, loved Virgin River. She's almost embarrassed at how many times she's watched it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. What's her name? Penny. Penny. Oh, she wants a single. Nice. Mm -hmm. There we go, Olivia. That's coming to you. Keep it in the day, Olivia. That's my advice to you. When things get stressful, just remember, it's only Saturday. Don't worry about Sunday too much. Okay, this is to Beth from Pennsylvania. Loved you and Grace, and really love you, Virgin River. Please write whatever comes to mind for my photo. I love whatever you put on it. Oh. Thank you for bringing Jack to life. Look at you, so serious in your doctor wear. Oh yeah, he was a, um, he, like doctors without borders, what do oh. they call it when they go and do, yeah. Oh yeah, he was involved in doctors too. Yeah, he was in Afghanistan or something. Um, okay, so this is to Beth. I feel like this color might be good, yeah. Oh, two. Beth. 
Really? Hmm. Well, I have one to, ch to Terry. We know nothing about you, Terry. But we're sending you love from Vancouver. Is that Terry? Terry. Whoa, Terry. <laughs> there you go. Well, I've got one for Karen. My mum loves Virgin River. I watched all four seasons in four days. Karen! Wow. Karen, that's a, that's, that's a lot of TV. That's a lot of hours. Four seasons in four days. <laughs> that might be a record. I mean, it is possible. I, it's, that's like, what? The entire waking time. Yeah. At least, right? Yeah. Because. They're not four hours. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So you basically Tweedledee and Tweedledum over here. <laughs> Everybody. <laughs> Forty minutes times ten. Four hundred minutes. Okay, Jack and Mel, so sweet. It's for my mom. Oh, I got a hook on Virgin River. Thank you for being so great. Oh, sorry about Sammy. Thank you, Karen. I appreciate that. Uh. Okay, two. Karen. C H. Oh, thanks. Yep. Sometimes I do that. For your, for your mom. We're okay, your mom must be Karen. Sometimes I start writing the ends of words before I, I write the too. beginning of the words. I'll get full sentences ahead of myself sometimes. Uh huh. There you go, no. Karen. It's coming to you. Dyslexia. At least they've gotten a handle on dyslexia in schools now. Don't you think it's a little bit better than it was? Because when I was a kid, I had dyslexia and they just put me in, um, you know, a full special learning program, but you know, with all the other kids in the school, and I just got teased all the time. Right, and you felt like you were, were you behind them? Were you I struggled? became behind them, I couldn't catch up, like it was just a total disaster. Yeah, well I think system. we've come a long way in understanding mm -hmm. what it is, and also understanding that with the right way of teaching, it can actually be a giant advantage, right, because the brain works in a, it works better in some ways than someone who's not dyslexic. Yeah. Great. <laughs> I don't know anything about that. That's great. Oh, come on. You're very smart. Uh, you are. So, I think it becomes an advantage in many ways. But I get what you mean. When, when we were kids, they didn't really understand it in the way they do now. Okay, this is to Sylvia. With love from Martin Henderson to Sylvia. With Rachel. Rachel wanted me to surprise her with a, a note and I I got lost talking about dyslexia. So I just said thank you for watching. <laughs> I forget quotes, I can't remember. Quotes are hard. Quote. Here we go. There you go, Sylvia. <clears throat> with love to you. Uh, next we have Esther, spelled E-S-Z-T-E-R. Dear Martin, I'm an ophthalmologist. If you need some help with your for your eyes, oh, Esther, where were you a few years ago? <laughs> oh my goodness! Well, thanks to these glasses, now I can read your name perfectly well. Um, I have another penny. There's so many pennies. Who knew there's so many pennies in the world? E S Z T E R. Um, with love. This one's to an absolute to Penny, an absolutely addicted fan. There you go, Esther. Oh. Hopefully, I won't have too much trouble with my eyes. <laughs> But I'll, uh, I'll remember you. Okay, Jules. Were they always that bad? I mean, I, you've never, you haven't been wearing glasses for the last few years, and all of a sudden you've got these thick as hell. I mean, well, only, they're happened? only thick. They're only thick on the bottom for reading. Yeah, but they're. But see, the top's not that bad. Distance, I'm fine. See, the top's not that much. It's just down there when you read. <laughs> I know. Season Woo! two was when I first noticed I was trying I've to read the mini slides, on my and I'd be like, oh, I can't read that anymore. <laughs> and then for the last three years, I've pretended I'm fine, and then it started hurting me so much. Mm. This year, I had this weird ache across my forehead, and I went to the 
Romulus just just oh. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> yeah. And uh, they were like, yeah, you need glasses, buddy. So. Yeah, I have some glasses. For It'll happen to you. It'll happen to you soon. Oh, stop it. I, I can't see tiny print anymore. That's done. Thank you, Rebecca. Rebecca. Kiwi Rebecca. Chick. Oh, Kiwi chick. Sorry, not to stomp on your, your uh, Rebecca there, but this is to Jules. Kiwi Chip! Kia ora, Jules! Happy 50th, girlfriend! Or maybe she's not a Kiwi Chick. Maybe her last name is literally Kiwi Chick. Could be her social handle, too. Um, mm. To Jules Kiwi Chick. Anyway. No, I'm pretty sure it's. A Kiwi girl, right? Yeah. Okay. Happy 50th, girlfriend! Okay. Olivia from California says that you're signing a print for her too. Um, I think we did a joint one to Olivia in California. You just did a solo for her, actually. Ah. Oh, I did a solo. Okay, yeah. there you go. Olivia, <laughs> you're getting, getting them all. That one's for Jules. Kiwi check. Kiwi check. Kiwi check. I like that. Happy birthday. Oh! Special happy fifth birthday. Happy five birthday. No, they meant 50th. Yeah. Happy birthday to Jules. Cool. The big 5 0. You know, the big 50 is the new 35. You hear that? I hope so. She's in a teaching <laughs> program. I'm hoping so too. I think you're stressful. A teaching program. Dearest Tracy. So are you learning how to teach? A teaching program? Mm. I didn't. Yeah, I just. Oh, I actually thought she was. Program. Yeah, I reckon she's learning how to teach. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's that's cool. That is that does sound stressful. <sighs> yeah. I mean, it's one of the most underpaid, most important jobs in society. If you really that and nursing, right? Like mm -hmm. without those two professions, we're all screwed. Okay, dearest Tracy, smart and beautiful. <laughs> smart and beautiful? Question mark. All my love. Um, <laughs> He's I don't okay. Think that's how she would like that. No, I think that's for her. Oh, yeah, that's for yeah. her. I'm going to say, <clears throat> Dearest Tracy. Racy Tracy. Smart and beautiful. I'm not, it's not a question mark. I'm just going to say, You smart and beautiful. Olivia, Thanks. I wrote you a note. Wrote you a little note there. Oh yeah, one of these ones. There you go, Tracy. Racy Trace. Francine Lopez. I'm going to gift this birth picture for my aunt, Michelle, who lives in Brazil. Please write to Michelle. She's a fan of Virgin River and Grey's <coughs> I am Fran, living in North Vancouver. Oh, they're right over there. Right across the water. Oh! Say hi, Francine. Hi, Francine. This, hi, one, Francine. Is, this one is to Lynn. This is for you, Lynn. I like this picture of this Lynn. one. I took this. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I took this while I was doing um, the last season of This Is Us in uh, LA, so I had long hair. Wow, that's a nice photo. Yeah. Yeah. I actually was able to uh, dye it before I did that show. Wow. Now I just sit here and eat pastries with Martin. Your, your hair's looking less orange though. No, it's, it's settled, it has, it's settled down a bit. I need to wash it. No, it's good. It's a little bit. It's nice. <laughs> I had my hair dyed a few days ago and it had become so... <laughs> it was bright orange. <laughs> it became so blonde that you had to put, you know, so much more copper tones in it, but it was just a little bit much. It was... Whoopsie. You know, when you get to the point in season five where my hair becomes orange, you'll know what we're talking about. <laughs> it was only a couple of days though, right? It's already settled down. Yeah, but that was a lot of... Those were a scenes. lot of scenes. <laughs> That's a lot of scenes where Mel's hair is orange. Uh, no, uh, look good. Look they're nice. gonna have a really fun time color correcting that. Great. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, this is to Francine. Uh, it's for okay. her aunt who lives in Brazil. No. No, 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 it's not. 
I'm not sure your name. You live in North Vancouver. You and your husband would like a coffee. Um, Her aunt lives in Brazil. Yeah. Please write this out to and Michelle. Oh, Let me get your name. Screwed it up. You know what? Let's. I'm just gonna do one to Francine. Uh, may as well. And, yeah. and you know what, Francine? If you don't want it, give it to someone you know called Francine who might. <laughs> so that's gonna come to you with the one for your aunt, Michelle, who have, lives in Brazil. I have one for Marianne in Ohio. Hmm. Ohio? Mm. Marianne, mm. do you have that accent? It's so good, this pastry. That was such a good idea. Marianne from Ohio? No, that's Minnesota. Mm. Ohio. Ohio. Cincinnati. Cincinnati is in... Is How do they speak in, in Cincinnati, Ohio? What's the it's kind of most dominant? It's like, it's like middle America, but I had... I did a movie across the border from Cincinnati. Is it Kentucky or Indiana? There's, oh my God. I forget, but I think it's like a general American. To Michelle with one L. Yep. This is to Maria. Is that Jose? Maria Jose. Yes. Yeah. Okay, Francie is coming to your aunt. No, yes, your aunt Michelle in Brazil. Okay. Maria Jose is from Chile, and she has an account, Alexandra Brecken, Brecken Chi. Oh, Chile. a Chilean right. thing. Oh, that's nice. Super excited to have this great opportunity. Lots of kisses. Lots of kisses to you, Maria. Here's another picture from that same photo shoot. <laughs> Oh wow! Wow! They got you looking sexy for um, this is us, huh? Well, no, no, no. This was a separate photo shoot just to have some pictures because I literally hadn't taken a picture since I had my daughter. So I was like, Yeah, I don't have a headshot need... since like. But that's why. Ten years ago. That's why I did. A... I was like, maybe we should have some new photos. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes. I should do that. You turned forty. It's a good idea to have new pictures. Okay, Jenna. That's for you. Uh, come visit Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania someday. I might just do that. How about those Steelers? Um, good luck with the rest of the football season. And thank you for your love of the show, Jenna. Okay, next is Evis Hall. Evis. Okay, it's a cool name. Evis, Evis, Evis. Sophie. <clears throat> Hannah. All right, Evis or Evis, much love to you, from me to you. Here we go, it's on your way. Next. This is from Hannah, from uh, Mary Ann. I'm a dentist, please write anything you desire to write me, Martin. Um, wow, a dentist. Dr. Miriam, Miriam Green. All right, that's two. Dr. Miriam. Davia, Davia. Um, I said be Divi, probably pronounced Divia, but I'm just guessing. Fantastic name. It really is. Via is a doctor in the UK. She'd love to work with me and Doc. Well, if we knew what we were doing. <laughs> Maybe. That'd be great. She, she could be a, <laughs> one of your medical technicians. Yeah. Okay. Talk to Marion Green. There you go. Thanks for keeping everybody's chompers strong and sparkling. Uh, I've got a lot of respect for dentists. I think that'd be a hard job. That would be such a hard job. Okay, this is to Sarah. Could you, Martin, please add the caption? Happy birthday. Oh, my wife's birthday. Oh, that's nice. Okay. To Sarah. 
Happy. Courtney, yes. No special instructions. Just wanted to let you know that you're my fave. Thanks. Happy birthday. Sometimes that's all you need to know, right? Yeah. Courtney, I'm excited for season five. As I've said, I'm also getting a little bit nervous. <laughs> oh, it's going to be a great, it's going to be a great one. Here you go, guys. That's for Sarah. Happy birthday. Or well, she probably isn't watching because it sounds like it might be a surprise. But I don't know. If she is watching, <laughs> happy birthday, Sarah, in Invercargill. Hope it's getting warmer down there. And then we have Mandy. I love Virgin River. I watched all four seasons in four days. Oh, hang on. No, someone else who did that. I really wanted an autograph picture from Virgin River. Thank you for being this so great. This is for Courtney. Jeez. Courtney, I hope you enjoy season five. I think, if anything, even if the bulk of the season makes people go, what's happening? The last couple episodes, which we were not are not telling you what happens in the last two episodes. Ooh, but I thought you were going to. No, I'm not <laughs> that stupid. Um, <laughs> you're going to love it. You're going to love it. going to love it. going to be your favorite. That's going to be, those are going to be, I think, some people's favorite episodes, don't you think? 100%. Last two of season yeah. five? Yeah. There you go. That's to Mandy. Thanks for being such a super fan. Four seasons in four days. It's <laughs> a lot Amazing. of love. That's a lot of love for you, Mandy. Okay, Deborah Thompson. D E B R A. This is from Mallory. Wherever you are in the world, Mallory. <laughs> There you go. Enjoy. Deborah Thompson, okay. coming your way. Christina, please sign. Always believe and have faith with love. Oh, Christina. With pleasure. To. Oh, here's Avril. She's the one that knitted those um, jackets. Oh, the Kiwi lady. Uh -huh. Oh, oh, April Fairbrother. April, yeah, we missed, uh, you saw her this year, didn't you? Uh, we met her at the bottom of the uh, gondola. I didn't see her. Oh, you went there that? No, I don't know, I didn't meet her. Oh, you had to see her earlier, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, April came all the way from New Zealand and tracked us down while we were filming out in the mountains and... Gave us some lovely handmade goodies. She bothered to knit us jerseys and beanie and socks. And she also dropped off a whole bunch of wonderful New Zealand chocolates and candy, which I've saved for two little people in my life that I think are gonna enjoy in a couple of weeks. So thanks for that. This is for you. Thank you for the goodies. Thank you for the goodies. Avril. Avril. Sarah from Arizona. Oh, Sarah from Arizona. Hot in Arizona. Is Dry in Arizona. Yeah. Dry. Okay, Christina. Always believe and have faith with love. Martin to you. Okay, to Beth. Love Virgin River and love the fact mm. you are so down to earth. Not quite sure where, where else you, you could be, but anyway, keep making great shows and thank you for what you do for us fans. Hope to be able to meet you someday. Oh, Beth, thank you for your kind words. And with much love, sorry, <laughs> from here to you, that's for you, Beth. Okay. And then Rebecca, uh, oh, no instructions. Okay, just two. Rebecca, two C's. Yep. Last one is to Christina. Maybe it was serendipity. Did oh. I say that? I don't remember saying that. <laughs> yeah, I think you did. Did I say yeah, that? Yeah, the fans are always right. Yeah, you did. Did I say maybe it was serendipity? Yeah, when we were having a date in season one and we were talking about fate. And, oh, yeah. I thought I just said fate. 
I think you might have done both. Oh. Unless it was yeah. a different scene. Um, I'm sure she's correct. Yeah. <laughs> That's to Nancy. There you go, Nancy. Okay, uh, I don't know which Grey's Anatomy, just the episodes, Martin is in. Aww. <laughs> That's very sweet, Laura. But if you watch Grey's Anatomy, you should probably watch the whole thing. There's like 15 or 16 seasons for you to is it? Is it think not? it's up to 16. Ah. Yeah. Don't At talk least. to me about that. <laughs> this is for Tamara. Thank you, Tamara. You're going to be like the Meredith Grey of Virgin River. I have watched Virgin River all seasons three times. Virgin oh, wow. Wow. Wow, Laura. What? That's a lot. She's watched all seasons three times. That's a shit ton of TV viewing. Wow. Um, Virgin River is a wonderful romantic realistic show. I hope it continues for many years. Oh, thanks, Laura. Think about think about how many takes. other things you could do with no, your life. No, think <laughs> about how many takes we do in a scene. So how many times we've done all the scenes that we've shot. Oof. Like how many times I've said those words over and over and over and over and over. Yeah. That's a lot. Yes. We should remember all of it. Yet, our brains are revolving doors. Comes in one side and out the other. My brain's just trying to get yeah. ready for what's coming up next week. And the week after that. Yes. Next week is a long week. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a big week. Yeah. A lot of actors in. Almost the whole cast. I think we're gonna do another tortilla challenge with some of Oh yeah, Alex came up with a really good idea. <laughs> Since our first tortilla challenge was such a non-starter. <laughs> uh, well, I just, I, I mean... No, we all yeah. saw exactly what you just... <laughs> <laughs> I can't help it, what do you want me to say? I can't... I've always been like that. I've it's always so if somebody funny. makes me laugh while I'm drinking something. It's, it's uh, you're in trouble. Game over. But we're gonna do a group one with a bunch of cast. We have a lot of cast that are in on one day, so we'll get as many as we can together in a circle. Let's see what we do you do six, like. Yeah. Um. Well, I think we should pick. I think there should maybe should be rounds. We could do rounds or something. Where you have like yeah three yeah yeah people. and the winner and the winners meet in the final yeah yeah okay so maybe we'll have three rounds or two round whatever you could do two rounds of three people yeah and then you'd have a first and a second place and then I don't know we'll have to come we'll up work with it out but we will have the, the Virgin River Tortilla Slap Championship <laughs> the undisputed champion will be decided next week. Okay, this is to Kleina. Kleina uh, looks from Italy. No, Ireland, sorry. Uh, Kleina, what a great name. Can you add a cute quote from Jack? Thank you, I'm a huge fan. Thank you for all your hard work. No show beats Virgin River. Oh, thank you, Kleina. Kleina, do you have any new funny stories with Alex Wells filming season five? Uh, um, does this one to... Is it you, sir? Lisa? What does it say? It says, sometimes I tell... Hi Alex, I'm a big fan from the UK, France. You are wonderful in everything you do. Keep smiling and dancing and hope to see you on our screens for many more years in VR. I love Mel and I sometimes tell myself to be more like Mel. Mer oh. Merci and a little heart. Oh, oh that's, that's a huge compliment. That's sweet. Sometimes I tell myself to be like Mel too. <laughs> Sometime I tell Alex, like, can you be a little more like Mel right now? Please? Just pretend. <laughs> can you just... Clean up. Oh, oh, I screwed it up. Oh, what did you do? I spelled, I spelled it the way it's pronounced, not the way she writes it. Gosh, do you need some more food? Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I totally do. Thank you. Mmm. Play no. No Annie Link, 
might be coming to meet me in February with her brother, Ezra. The weather's good. From Carolina? Oh, yeah. Cool. Nice. Nice, Annie. Maybe I'll see you there. Good plan on. I can't, I, I hope that Corona's not raging. I can't decide if I'm gonna be masked up or not. I think I might be. I might be. What was that quote that we found from Jack before? Annie. What did, what did you put? The wow, that was easy? Uh, I thought there was going to be more back and forth. What? Um, did you come up with a... Wait, did we miss that? Did you come up with the funny thing that happened in season five? I, well, well, I, I do, can't, I can't give away yeah, something. Uh, yeah, I just thought of something too, but it's Spoiler, so it's not. Yeah. Um, some sunny, sunny, sunny fiends. There's some sunny fiends with Jack and his family. The Sheridans turn up with some funny stuff we did yesterday. But I can't give it anyway. No. Uh, yeah, do you have any funny stories with Alex while filming season five? Um, camping? Was anything funny happening camping? Um, no. My the the pipe burst in my B and B. That wasn't very funny. No, that was, that was like the opposite <laughs> of funny. Well, it make you laugh. Tell that story. Oh, no. Tell them how you ended up in this apartment. Oh well, no, that wasn't here. I know. That's well. I I ended up at Wendy's after that. No, I went to I went to visit my family. I think I probably already talked about this. I went to go visit my family, um, and then I came back and I told the owner of the B and B that I was leaving. And I came back and um, she failed to mention the fact that a pipe burst in the house and there was a giant hole with caution tape around it in the front yard. When I got out of my Uber, and I walk over to the house and I'm like, Oh my God, what's going on? And um, the, all the doors were unlocked. And uh, the stuff had been moved around because, and there was like a dehumidifier all over the place and like clearly they'd been like draining through the washroom with tubing and I was just, I called her, all the water was off. I said, I can't, you know, what's going on? And she said, oh, sorry. I was like, well, it, it, what do you mean, sorry? <laughs> so anyways, I left B&B. But we were doing this really heavy episode that week and I had to be up at 4 a.m like consecutively for the next four days and I had to go live in a hotel um, and I packed up all my stuff and I just, gosh, that was really hard. Yeah, you had the worst luck. With that was really stuff. difficult. And your luggage got stolen? Oh, my husband's, yeah, my kids and my husband's luggage just got stolen from the airport. But they found, they used the air tag. So these are really funny stories. And track. <laughs> Hope we're just cracking you up over there. Uh, yeah. Anyway, that was Baclana. Sorry, <laughs> that last one was Baclana. Um, I wrote a little quote there from Jack to you. Yeah, I can't remember anything like that funny that's happened. Not that we haven't had fun, it's just... We have fun all the time. I know. Pamela from Quebec says, um, hi. She loves lift guys. Pamela. Um, I mean, funny things happen all the time I, at work. Don't they? I just can't remember what they are. Um, I think if I ate some food, I might be able to remember a few things. Do you have more snacks? I have another sandwich for you. This is Margarita. Um, oh, this is to Margarita, another fellow Libra. Hey. This is from Libra. Pamela from Quebec. I'm gonna go get your sandwich. Oh, thank you. Um. So I guess the pastry wasn't enough. <laughs> uh. <laughs> All right, Margarita, my lovely fellow little Libra, this is coming to you. Sending you love and best wishes. Next, I have Anne Dorte Nielsen 
from Denmark. Uh, oh, I've seen many of your films. I'm looking forward to seeing your work. Take good care of yourself. Thanks, Anne. This is for Jennifer. We don't know where you live, Jennifer. I hope you have a happy Saturday and um, happy holidays when they come. I'm all ready for the holidays, obviously. I've got my holidays on. Those are great pajamas. I really got to get some for Billy. I, I wonder if they have some. I don't have a pair of pajamas. I literally had to borrow this from the costume department. Dare I ask you what you sleep in? Boxes. Oh, just boxers. Nothing else. Just boxers. See, oh, I boxes can't... and a pair of jeans and a hat. I mean, what are you No, I mean like a shirt. I don't know. <laughs> oh, like a t-shirt? Like pants? Like, I don't know. No, no, no. A pair of, uh, a pair of boxes. Okay. Yeah. Because I get cold and sometimes I have to wear a sweatshirt. I have a very light sweatshirt. Oh, I, I have a duvet. Bed. It's like it's filled with feathers and then you can just pull it up. <laughs> you should try. I, sure. I you wouldn't have to wear clothes. I still get cold. With a duvet. Yeah. Yeah. I can't wear just like underwear. You get cold. Yeah. Huh. Okay. <laughs> no, just boxes. Unless I'm wearing nothing at all. That's a conversation for another day. Okay. Okay, to Denise. <laughs> oh. To Denise. All right, Denise, this is coming to your door, to your post office box or your mailbox real soon. Oh. Here you go. Paloza. Paloza. Judy Paloza. Paloza. Judy Paloza. Paloza. This is for my mom. She's a huge fan of yours, Fred River. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thanks. This is for Judy. So this is for somebody's mother named Judy. Um. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year's, Happy Birthday. I have a I have a story. Oh, here we go. I have a story for you. Um, we had a scene where Alex, we're in the McRae cabin, and Mel has to wake Jack up, but his back's turned to her. Oh, yeah. And she comes up and says, hey, Jack, Jack. And Jack's supposed to turn around and be like, oh, hi, good morning, and then the scene goes on, whatever. But Alex thought it might be funny no, that was Lynn's idea. Was it her idea? Yeah. Okay, my makeup artist, Lynn, decided it would be funny that while we were doing a take, instead of Alex waking me up, it would be her. So I'm all ready, I'm, you know, like, stand by, camera's ready, action! I'm pretending to be asleep, and then I hear this little footsteps come over, and then this hand touches me on my shoulder. I turn around, and it's my makeup artist. It was very funny, so I pulled her into bed with me. He pulled, he pulled her into bed <laughs> on top of him. That yeah, pretty good. pretty good. This is to Yvonne, um, McDonald. Where is she from? Ireland. Ireland. Oh yeah, best wishes from Ireland. Oh. I haven't been to Ireland in so long. I love the Irish. I love the Irish. Okay, this is to Michelle Keith. Oh, g'day, mate. Michelle Keith, all the way down there in Hunter Valley, New South Wales. Um, wants me to say hi. G'day, or hi. Um, but in all seriousness, thank you for your message about Sammy. Um, I appreciate that. And you said you know how that loss feels, which means you obviously lost your pup at some point. I'm sorry for you too. But we are lucky to have them for the time that we have them. So we can just cherish their memories. But thank you for that, Michelle. Sending you this with lots of love. Uh, this is a little sexy photo for Jeremy. Here you go, Jeremy. Ooh, Jeremy. Oh, get it. Get it, Jeremy. <laughs> Eat your food. Eat your sandwich. <laughs> Jeremy's going to love that one. Oh. Jeremy's going to love that one. Oh, dear. All right. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Next we have... Trish. This is 
Trish. Okay. These next few for you are all to the same person. FYI. That's for Trish. Oh. Trish. With love and a little bit of salmon bagel. Here you go. Salmon mm. bagel. Good idea. You want me to cut some off? No, no. No, no, please, please, you eat that. <laughs> mm. Please. Do us all a favor, Martin. <laughs> yeah. Get some food into you. Yeah, this is to Judy. It's amazing to me how much food you can eat. Like, how much food I can eat? You eat a lot of food. You mm -hmm. eat all damn day. It's because this my one. my blood sugar can't hold the glucose. To yep. Osama. That's a cool name. Nice. Osama. Yep. He's actually bought a string of them, so the next several are. Oh, Osama. they're Osama. Thanks for your patronage, Osama. buddy. Oh, These give, me, give me Judy back. <coughs> give me Judy back. I'm gonna add something to Judy's. Glad you enjoy the show. Sorry, Judy. I missed the special note. I'm gonna add that. Osama, do you really enjoy Virgin River? What, because he's a dude? Well, no, it's just a lot of, it's Good just duty. several Virgin River. But I, I, are you sure that he wants them all to? Mm -hmm. so. mm -hmm. Lynn Van, Lynn Van Weerts? 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 I don't know. Lynn Van Weerts. Nickname Lily. Hey, Lily. Oh, every time I watch Virgin River, I forget bad moments, see? That's sweet. Isn't that nice? It's so nice that has that effect on you. Thank you, Lily. Oh my gosh, she had two cancers in seven years. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. A, I'm a survivor. Aww. Wow. Lily, congrats. You must have a very, very strong spirit. A respect to you. I'm glad you fought and you're still in this wonderful world. Yeah, that's really hard. Well, two. Lily, it's the first American Horror Story one to come through. Also, you know the other ones are better. The other ones are better with the where you can see the full front, the front of the main outfit with the. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that other one. That other one. What is it? I more enjoy that one. I think more than this one. Probably because this is not. This is a little more creepy, and the other one's really. You know, you see the. Yep. Yeah. Garter and the whole bit. Garter. What a funny thing. Life is funny. <laughs> Our jobs are funny. A strange yeah. thing. There you go, Lily. Lynn, with love to you. All right. Sometimes I forget about this, you know, and then I look back and I see some like gif of me ripping off the garter belt or like my butt waving in the air, and I'm just like, what happened? <laughs> what a thing. Thank you. Yep. Seemed like a good idea at the time. It really did. <laughs> it really did seem like a good idea at the time. People really enjoyed it. I'm sure they did. I think they're continuing to enjoy it for years. Yeah, That's right? good. It's a gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> Still Osama, still going. We got a few more. Osama is a, a big fan. fan. About one of each, I think. Oh wow. my gosh. I wonder where Osama lives. Oh, so this is the Dr. Marion Green again. Mm hmm. Okay. Wow. I'm just going to do Marion. What does she want, Doctor? No, I guess it says Doctor. Osama just wanted to watch me sit here and and write his name over and over again. I think he'd rather <laughs> watch you in a pair of suspenders and <laughs> suspenders. 
or whatever you're wearing. It's called a garter belt. A garter, garter. <laughs> mm. A garter belt? Garter belt. Very low garter belt. Very high dress. She doesn't move. Um. Ah, oh, this is one of my favorites. I love this one. It's good splatter. It's a good one. This was really good splatter. Well, they made a chest, a full chest uh, prosthetic that went on top of her, and that inside it was a cavity of blood, so that when I stabbed it, blood came out. Not sure. Oh, that's cool. not not your average squib. It doesn't no. sound like Virgin River. They did have a, <laughs> oh my god! They did have a. Pump. Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> they had a. They did have a, um, a a line that went through her pant leg, and somebody was pumping, pumping the blood. blood from the what side. What show was that? Walking Dead. That was so much fun. <laughs> that was the funnest. I had the best time doing that scene. You could tell on my face. Yeah, you're really going for it. That was yes. Changing gears a little bit, uh, <laughs> Dr. Marion Green, that's for you, sending you a little personal message. Thank you very much. And next we have Katie, you and Alex's sense of humor warms my heart, warms my heart, the cockles of my heart. Thank you from Colorado. Cockles. All right, Katie from Colorado. Last, last Osama one. Okay, Osama, this is your last one here. <laughs> Are you cutting them off? Well, no, it's just the end of the line. It's okay. just, that's the one that he got. Here we go, Katie. Keep smiling with love from me to you. Oh my god, this sandwich is working a treat. Thank you. There you go. Oh, well, yeah. at least you brought, you brought extra food for yourself. Yeah, yeah. Smart hands. Oh, Bobby, there's extra there. If you want to, um, mm. forget what I got, but do the sandwich. This is to Kim. Kim? Oh, be still my beating heart. Oh. Okay, Kim, I'm gonna write that. To Kim. Be still. All right. Sabrina. Sabrina Vogler. Oh, she was the first one we did today. Yeah, I was mm -hmm. like, I know that name. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know that name. This episode inspired me to buy a pair of binoculars. Huh. Oh, and look this at the eagle. sign, Virgin River, is a utopia. There you go. That's for Kim. Oh my God, she watched off the map. Wow, thanks for sticking around, Kim. Okay, Sarah. Sarah. Hi from Sarah. From a big Jack Sheridan fan. Could you please write to Sarah? Thank you so much for last night. Ha <laughs> ha ah. Sarah, I thought that was our little secret. Now I've just said it publicly. Oh, cat's out of the bag. But Sarah, I think, yes. I'm very grateful for last night. Uh, that's Northern German humor, okay. I think that's New Zealand humor too, Sarah. This is for Sabrina. Um, for, uh, Virgin River is a utopia. Sure is. Sure is. Wish I lived there. <laughs> I live there in my land to pretend. You live there for four months of the year. I do live there for four months of the year, it's true. Thank you. Brian from so Winnipeg. Much. Got a cameo from you last year. Oh, for your birthday. Just want to say hi. Keep up the last amazing night. work. Hi, Brian. Hope you're doing well. In Winnipeg. I've never been there. 
That's Canada, right? Winnipeg? Mm -hmm. like... Yeah. Okay, Sarah, Sarah from Hamburg, beautiful Hamburg, for you. Hamburg, amazing. Germany. Brian from Winnipeg. To Gail, stay safe. Okay. Are you blanking out? No. Um, nope. I'm great. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, Gail. Mm. Mm. For you. Next we have Anna. Could you please write to Anna from Jack and from your awesome big sister, Sarah? Yes, I can do that. That's easy. Thank you once again from Hamburg. Oh. Oh, this must be the same one for someone else. Oh yeah, I go, I know what's going on here. Uh, shine on sailor. Oh, thank you so much. Sh shine on you. Uh, Sarah, but this is for Anna. So to Anna. going to Anna. I presume Anna's not watching, otherwise it wouldn't be much of a surprise. But if she is, Anna, would love for me to you. Maybe the surprise is to watch sitting this. Sitting here watching us for, for seven hours. hours. <laughs> <laughs> surprise! It's only been two and a half so far. Oh, we're, uh, we're getting through it. We're getting through it, guys. It's only been two and a half hours. I don't know what's worse. It's like let them order so many prints that they have to sit for hours and wait, or limit the amount that they can. Maurice Lucia, yeah. it's a great name. Lucia, I love that name. Lucia, Lucia. Aquet. Aquet. Cindy, from me to you, babe. Okay. Special instructions. Oh, wait a minute. Hi, Sue. Omaha, Nebraska. Belinda Fish. Chatting with these new chats. So it sounds like the autograph is to Belinda, and then she'd like me to give verbal shout outs to those other names. Oh, Avril's one that was too. Please give a shout out to. Avril, Joanne, Carrie. Hi, Avril. Hi, Joanne. Hi, Carrie. Hi. That's for Courtney. That's for you, my love. She wants another cooking show, if Courtney does. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't know how we're going to squeeze all that in. I know, actually. I don't know, timing wise, when we do it. Okay, Phyllis Trudeau. I think you got a joint one now. Here we go. A little hinder for you. Here we go, Phyllis. Linda. Oh, Linda's from Brisbane as well. 
Oh my god, Linda, let's talk about this for a second. First saw me in Echo Point. Wow. That show was pretty bad. We used to call it Echo, what's the point? <laughs> It was, oh it, was, it was pretty bad, but my God, Linda, thank you for staying with me for that many years and absolutely love Secrets and Lies. Oh, God love you, Linda. Sending you lots of love to Brizzy. Thank you for watching, Linda. Here we go. That's for you. Okay, this is to Mildred. Hey from Betty, let's the Dominican Republic. Let's meet. Let's meet at church for lunch. Let's meet. Okay, Betty, oh Betty, little cutie. Two. Betty. Uh, this is for Betty. I'll meet you at Jack's for lunch, baby. It's for you, my love. Big shout out to my main boys, PD and Chevy. Mwah. Love you guys. Can't wait to see you soon. You want an autograph, PD? Yeah? Um, From Martinary? Happy birthday, Caitlin. <laughs> Love you guys. And this is to Tina. To Tina, thank you for being you. Love from Sweden. Aww. Love to you. It's starting to stink like a fish. No, that's why I offered you half. I thought it might be less offensive. Stinky. <laughs> there you go, Tina. You know what Martin does to me sometimes? He'll eat a tuna fish sandwich or like a fish sandwich. Four seeds, and it's not even like we're maybe we're not doing any of that stuff, but we're really close when we talk most of the time. We're right up in each other's business, and he can he can have some real some real fishy some real fishiness happening there. I'm gonna get you some more water, my friend. Oh, thank you. <laughs> it's like my mom. <laughs> yeah. You you've had the odd. Uh, Bowl of tuna though while we've been working, but you always put those weird. I always spray use... your mouth with that horrible. Yeah, stuff. I always try to freshen my breath so that I'm not like. Hi. <laughs> 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 Sometimes I get a bowl of tuna and then I gotta 
you know. Emily, I just thing. I just want you to know that your <laughs> photograph was used to waft away the smell um, smoked salmon. Smoked salmon stink that's coming off of Martin Henderson's breath right oh, now. Oh dear. <laughs> Who would have me? Okay. <laughs> to end. Please sign it. Thanks for watching. Best wishes. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it's only funny because it's true. <laughs> Thanks for watching. To Mandy. Bad. You go in. That's for you. Thanks for watching. Okay, this is for okay, Tracy. That's all of the real estate here. Tracy. Tracy. Oh, that's kind of cool though. Mix it up. Make gold. It Maybe some gold. I like the gold. Yeah. Two. Crazy. Money. Oh, that was stupid, actually. This. What? Oh, it did. Uh, the well, color is probably not. Well, it works. It worked right in a shirt. I know. It worked right in a shirt. It's okay. It's alright, alright? It's alright. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here you go, Tracy. In your way. Okay, this is for Robin Marianne Kristen. This one's for Brandon Bunderson. Brandon Bunderson. BB. BB, I like that name. BB. Marianne is mum and daughters also watch Virgin River and your movies. Love getting cameos, more cooking on Instagram with Mel. Thanks for being so gracious with your fans. Ah. Guys, you don't have to thank us for being gracious. It comes naturally because you guys are the best fans in the world. Mm. Um, and that's true. Carmen from Alabama missed the joint signing. Sorry. Um, but uh, we're here and I'm gonna sign this for you. Missed the joint. So you um, are on the joint signing. Missed. Well, I think because we have a limited amount of duo signings, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, she found the show while she was recovering from surgery. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people have told me that. They were recovering from something, or they got sick, and they started watching it, and then they just kept on watching. Keep on keeping on, on people. I'm a bit confused here. It says, to Robin, Marianne, Kristen, but I think that's three people's names, because it says Marianne's mum, Sometimes it's for a whole so family. Maybe it's two all three. Yeah. So you should do it to all three, right? Yeah. Okay. Two Robin. And Marianne and Kristen. Yeah, that looks like it's to the family. Marianne and Kristen. Thank you, Carmen. Here you go guys, Robin, Marianne, and Kristen, thanks for watching. Next we have Mary Corey, a fan from Ireland. Love Virgin River so much, I'm a nurse. Oh, here you go. Uh, Just like Mel Monroe. And you guys were my place to relax when off duty during the pandemic and always will be. Thank you, Mary. You get a lot of really nice notes. Um, this is for Diane. And you love Diane. To Mary. If you sign on live, can you say hi? Hi, Maddie. Florino, Florena, Florena. Maddie Florena, yeah. Florena, yeah. What is that thing? That little... It looks like a mouse. Or something else. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh! I really don't know. Oh, I'm gonna leave that alone. I don't know. But it's supposed to be, yeah. Um, Alright, moving right along. Mary, that's for you! <laughs> I hope yeah. you're doing well over there in Ireland. Oh, Mel reminds you of yourself sometimes. Nice! That's a big compliment. You must be a nice person. <laughs> you must be a really nice person. Um, Two I'll just put ago. a smile on my face. Oh. The scene of me dancing 
I have another dancing bit coming up. You could say that, that's fine. I dance in season five. Remember? Oh yeah, oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's a really good one. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> oh yeah, you're gonna love this season, guys! <laughs> this season's so good! It's so fresh, oh it's so funny, oh it's so dramatic, oh it's so exciting, God. it's tragic, it's romantic, <laughs> it's gleeful, it's suspenseful, it's got darkness, it's got light, it's got hope, it's got faith, it's got laughter, it's got everything you could wish for and more. And you only have to wait till next July. <laughs> okay, this so is to Yuko. Seven more months. Yuko, signing this to you, sweetheart. Seven more months, Maddie, and then you can watch me dance again. And does she dance a storm? I do. Here you go, you go. Okay, Sasha lives in Brisbane. Please write, thanks for your support. Also write Nathan Riggs under your sick. This is a gift from my friend Sasha, a great super fan. I, Jody, am in heart failure. Oh, Jody, and has and she has been there for me. Oh, Jody. Signed photo of Gray's cardiothoracic surgeon seems fitting. Oh, Jody. Well, I'm really glad that you have the support of a friend like Sasha, and I wish you all the best in your recovery. Um, this is just for Sylvia. <laughs> Sylvia didn't write a note. <laughs> Hi, Sylvia. This is for Sasha. today, Deepa, just because there, there's like hundreds, <laughs> so we're trying to get as many done as we can in this session, but... Uh, it would be lovely if he could, but I think that would be... Um, we don't have it would be more for rude. today. It would also just be rude to other people <laughs> if we did that, you know what I'm saying? It's not, it's not anything... Uh, Against you, but I will open. I will open up again in the new year once I find some time after Christmas and all that jazz. So, deeper, I will send you one on the next signing. And this is to Sasha. Well, but it's Jody. It's coming to you, I guess, and you're going to give it to Sasha. Please give Sasha my love and uh, all the best to you. To Jody with a Y. The eyes. You, Jody, with a Y. Wherever you the are. Eyes of the window to the soul. Hi, Mark. You did my cameo in the hallway of your hotel in an evening. Huge fan. What was I doing in the hallways of a hotel in the evening? Yeah, what were you doing? I don't know. <laughs> Huge fan of yours. I was the lawyer, but now I am the wind job. I guess that's between jobs, and it's frightening. Oh, could you write to never give up in life? I need a push in the back right now. Inez, 
You sound like you're doing just fine. You know exactly what to do, sweetheart. You just keep on keeping on. Keep on trucking, Ennis. Just stay open and have faith. And remember, say no. Say no to the good so that you can be open to the great. You deserve the best, okay? All right, take it away there. Say no to the good. Yeah. Someone's like, oh, I'll tell you, yeah, it's good. No, sometimes you've got to know you deserve great. you got to yeah. say no to good sometimes in order to make way for great. Don't let good be the enemy of the great. I, well... But if you settle for mediocrity, that's fine too. I mean, that's, that's totally fine. I don't, I'm not judging, I'm just saying if you want. Yeah, I, well, but I, but I, uh... Alright, I'm not going to expand on that because I think that would be incorrect. Um, this is to J Kelly and Jason. Nobody wants to hear that story, I was about to tell you. Uh, <laughs> very counter to what we're doing here. Okay, to Ennis. Readiness. Here we go. Got a little message there for you. To Mike, a fellow Torian. His birthday is May 5th. <laughs> What's your date? 15th. Bonjour, Martin. J'espère que tu vas bien. J'adore Virgin River et Blaise Anatomy. Je te trouve formidable dans le rôle de Jacques. Je suis un patient de voir le deuxième saison. Peut de dire quelques mots en français. Robisou de Belgique. So oh. why you got that message and not me? Um, Mike. Yeah, <laughs> This is for you. Um, fellow Torian. Torian? Is that how we say it? Torian. 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 Thing to do, and then you were 
you said something, I was like, I thought, like, what, does your husband just like, say, hey baby, get the quilts out, get the quilts out. Could, maybe we could do it together. Could you teach me how to do that? The way you like, you put that little patch on? Is that not rude? I mean. It was just a legitimate question. I'm curious, I've, I've never, I've never hung out with anybody who's been in the act of quilting. So I'm just wondering if it like, evokes a lot of enthusiasm from everyone else in your life. People think it's cool, okay? Because it's such a nerdy You know what, thing that's why yeah, it's cool. That's the only reason it's cool, is because it is Be kind of... Because young women like myself in the young, modern age... Young, <laughs> I'm younger than you! <laughs> that's not saying much. <laughs> You're a stinker. This is what I have to deal with. Unbelievable. Un <laughs> oh. You know, Jack and Mel aren't married yet. So I don't know. I've oh, got many seasons for that. Uh, I don't know. Uh. Mel might end up with a wandering eye. <laughs> I'm sure Jack would be so supportive of Mel's quilting. He actually is, come to think of it. Well. Yeah. Kind of, you know, yes. Yeah, yeah, can't say too much, but yes. Way, way, well, much more, yeah, supportive than you. Yeah, oh, 100%. It's not that I'm not supportive, just I'm, just, I'm just really curious. This I'm just really shows the blurring difference between Martin Henderson, the person, and, and Jack, Jack Sheridan. Sheridan, the character. Jack has a way bit bigger love for quilting than me, it's true. <laughs> no, no, he's just... Does, does, does your husband really love it? Like, does he like get into it? No. Does he, he like drag it out? You don't have to get into quilting. I think it's just an appreciation of someone's interest in a craft that is the nice, the nicer way to be about it instead of being like, why would you do that? Because that's literally what you said to me. You were like, why, why would you want to ever do that? Yeah, you never answered. Because that was such a fucking rude question. It's not rude. It's, it I'm curious. It's like, why would you? Why? Like all the things you could do with your time on Earth, you, ch you actually volunteer to do that. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just honestly it's curious. Like, to me. like <laughs> you're so. Like you do photography, and I'm like, oh, that's cool. Like I get that. Like yeah, you go around, you take photos of people and buildings and but sunsets. Just because you don't understand somebody's interest in a craft, and you think that it's silly, doesn't. I didn't say it was silly. I said, why would you do that? That means and you, you have, think it's silly. Well, unless you tell me a reason and then I'm like, oh, wow, that's not silly. That sounds cool. I might try that one day. But you're yet to elaborate on why you do it. But I'm sure it's super cool. I think cool. I enjoy the geometry of it and I like the pre precision of... I like making a pattern, creating a pattern. That's what I like about it. I don't know. And I like sewing. Is it like together. is it like something that you get lost in? Is it kind of meditative? Yeah. 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 Okay. I never answered you because I thought it was rude. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure there's plenty of things that I've said to you and you've gone, why would you do that? That just sounds like no. why would you go camping? Why would you why would you want to like ride like your bike camping. through the rain, mountain biking? No, I I mean you are a very sporty person. Yeah, and I bet you, there's lots of things that you're like you've gone like, Ugh, no, why, I why would you do that? No? I just don't do those things because I don't want to break my bones. Right. I don't want to. I don't, don't judge wanna, you for it. I don't want to quilt because I I'm just, not a jerk. I, I just basically. don't want to. I don't want to like pass out from boredom. <laughs> I'm not telling you don't have to be quilting. It's fine. You don't need to quilt. I think it's safe to say I won't. <laughs> I know you're not going to. I was hoping you were gonna like say something and I'd be like, oh wow. I can't believe it's like you've ripped the scales from my eyes and now I can see that this is clearly something that I should be doing. No, I would never assume that you would want to do such a thing. I was exactly. I was just sharing a simple fact about my interests. This is for you, Elizabeth. <laughs> I thought you were half joking. Thank joky. you for being a huge fan of the show. Um, she says this show means so much to me. It's a pleasure watching you. Thank you for being part of it. Well, it's it's my pleasure to be a part of it, even though my co-host here doesn't uh, support your crocheting. No, was it? My, uh, 
Here we go. Hobbies. That's to car this well, this is to Carol, but it's for your mum, Carlisle in Pennsylvania. I hope it brings a little smile to her face. And if it doesn't, perhaps you could introduce her to the craft of quilting. Might do the trick. Okay, to Emma. That should be made up. That should be made up to Carol, actually. No, Carlisle, Pennsylvania is the town they're from. Uh, this is to Amy. Thank you for the sweet <laughs> note, Amy. I'm so glad that enjoy the show. On that one. It's almost 2 p.m. you guys, you know what that means. That was Carol. You know what that means. Okay, this one's Carol. It's time for a glass of wine. <laughs> you know what that means. It's time for mom to have a little helper. I'm going to sushi tonight. I'm very excited about it. You got a, su hey, you got a sushi hill. <laughs> sushi uh, downtown. Oh, downtown. yum. Okay, this is to your mom, Carol. Here you go in Pennsylvania. All right, this one is to Emma Miller. This is to Casey. That's my husband's name. I wonder if it is. It's a boy or a girl. We don't know. Or maybe a, maybe they. Not sure. Here you go, Emma. That's to you. Just smoking aces action. Sandy from England, just to say absolutely love Virgin River. Thank you, Martin and Alex. You both are so funny off camera, but really not funny at all in front of the camera. <laughs> Is that what it said? No, that's how I added that last <laughs> No, You're we're not funny in front of the camera. No. It's not exactly we don't get comedy any... in front of the camera. No. <laughs> you did a little funny beat the other day. That was cute. With what? Um, I don't know, you came in, or we're not going to say what scene it was, because that's, you came in. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, that's a little over the top, but yes, good no, to No, it was it cute, bit, I right? liked it. Okay. To Sandy. To Sandy from England. Hi, Sandy from England. Just to say, I've seen a little thank you, my name. Oh. Yeah, I think everyone's going to really enjoy the last two episodes of season five, because there's a lot more lightness and uh, yes, humor and playful. It's just, it's a really sweet, funny sweet. couple of episodes. All right, now I have to find a quote. The end is gonna be so good. Like, yes. so good. That moment was perfection. Uh, Here we go. Sandy, that's you for you. Are you talking about what I'm thinking you're talking about? Yeah, what we did the other night. Well, what you, you did the other night, to be specific. Oh. That's which I cannot really? speak of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know. No, 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 no. You think it's going to be good? Yeah, yeah. It, I know it is. It's, mm. See, so here's the thing. Sometimes we do scenes and we're like, oh, did that work? <laughs> <laughs> it's the truth of it. Is that even printable? Is that even, yeah. Does that even make it to air? We, I mean, a lot of the time we've done scenes and walked away and looked at each other like, oh no. I just go like this. <laughs> oh, oh my god. It's over. It's oh, over. It's, it's over. That's, it doesn't get any worse than that. But somehow. Somehow it comes together. I think You were sorry. very good in that scene. Really? Yeah. I, yeah. Really? Yeah. Are we thinking about the same scene? The, the, the last scene we did. No, 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 no. You were terrible in that. <laughs> <laughs> See? It does happen. It does happen. That was just. No, you weren't. I'm joking. Hard. You weren't all horrible in that. That'll be beautiful. But no, the, the scene that we shot. It wasn't great. It wasn't great. It was supposed to be this, like, big. Yeah, but the way it was going to be. It's going to be gorgeous. Yeah, but the, the, the scene where I'm on the porch, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. The last scene we shot together, I think. I wasn't really in it much. Oh. Yeah, that. This is to Laura. You didn't see my face, though. Did you? It's to you. Yeah, I did. When? Uh, on the playback. Oh, you watched a playback? Yeah. 
It's really, oh. really nice. That whole thing is going to be... Yeah. yeah, it was very sweet. Yeah, yeah. It's great. Oh, and that's the Yes, end. yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> notes and yeah it was great oh let me know your favorite season of the year and why oh i thought you meant the show my favorite season of the year it's got to be summer i just love being outdoors i love being in the mountains and on the ocean and i love building fires and being outdoors so summer sandra is my favorite I've got a good quote for you, actually. Yeah. Uh, the internet, the internet is slow, but the gossip is fast. Oh yeah, that was a funny That's one. A good one. Here we go, Sandra. Whatever your favorite season is, I hope you get to enjoy it. I quite like fall though. Like we're here in Vancouver right now, and it's autumn. And it's like today, it's a sunny day. There's a float plane that just flew over the city. It's going to land in the harbor. There's little sailboats bobbing on their anchors. There's pine forests on an island. There's snowy mountain peaks. There's birds flying through. There's different- It's gorgeous out right now. It's ridiculous. So pretty here. I love it, but I'm, I like it because we're only here for a short while. To Melissa. Melissa, I wrote a quote on the bottom for you. To Laurie. You? This is to you, Laurie. Mwah. Ah, thanks, Diane. Diane wrote me a lovely little note. That's very sweet. Thank you. What are you gonna? People are still watching us. Mm -hmm. What are you gonna cook for um, Christmas dinner? Christmas or Thanksgiving? Did I just do Laurie? I did, didn't I? Are you gonna That's completed? Look at the number on the back. Yes, you just did Laurie. So okay, nice. I'm Carolyn. Okay. Are you gonna do Thanksgiving or are you gonna be on a boat for Thanksgiving? Oh, you. On the 25th, I'll be on a boat. I'll be in Mexico. I don't think they do Thanksgiving in Mexico. Oh, look, see, that annoys me. That's they hang the sweaters on the coat hanger and yeah. it drives me nuts. Yeah. You should fold them, right? Yes. So this is to care all of them. So tell us what you're going to do for Thanksgiving now. Well, I do like, you know, a traditional American Thanksgiving. Well, for all of those non-Americans out there, what would that be? Okay. Um, <clears throat> I will do, I will brine my turkey. Oh, that sounds sexy. Yeah. Does the turkey, you it need to ask permission? It basically gives it a little turkey? bath and you give it a little cold bath. I do, um, well, you, you take a big old pot and you dilute a bunch of salt and seasonings, bay leaves, uh, white wine, and you know, like juniper berries, peppercorns, um, mustard seeds, all sorts of things. Put the turkey in it and, and you did like, wrap up a turkey bag and leave it in the fridge for 24 hours. And it soaks in all soaks that flavor. Soaks in all of the salt and the juices, so it, ke it keeps the flavor when you're cooking it, and it keeps the moisture in when you're cooking it better, because you've just pumped it full. You've hydrated it. Yeah. Oh, really wow. Good. Really good. She's, she's quite the entertainer, this one. Yeah. Quite the homemaker. So we'll do that, and then um, I'll make, the night before, I usually make yams, I used to mash them and put marshmallows on the top, but now I like to do them cut up into cubes, and then I roast them in like um, butter and, and uh, brown sugar. Um, so it's a very low a caloric too. dinner. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. You'll get your. You gotta watch. You gotta watch yourself. You gotta um, go for a run before dinner and then after, after dinner. Yeah. Wow, that sounds and I amazing. Used, I used my stepmother taught me the, the stuffing, which people call dressing in the Midwest, the Midwest but it's um, 
you take uh, Italian sausage, uh, do the sauce, you know, saute the sausage, and then you add the breadcrumbs, and then yeah. Chicken broth Time on it. or anything like like herbs yeah. or anything. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Onions. Yeah. So that's a separate thing, right? And then you just bring that out. You serve that. You cook yeah, that you bake beforehand. It. Yeah. So I cook it the night before with the yams, um, stuffing, and potatoes. Then I'll set up the green beans, and if I do carrots, I'll cut those up the night before. Because this is, the turkey is a big to do. Yeah. Just once that. you're roasting the turkey, you have to keep basting, basting. it. How many, how often, like every hour? Every like hour, every 30 minutes, you know, um, it you, takes a while. Do you burn yourself? Because are you bringing that sucker in and out? Or you're yeah, doing well I have a new stove. Thank you very much, Persian River. I have a new stove. <laughs> so the new stove has the, it like glides out the rack. Oh, oh out really nice fancy. Thing. Yeah. What so, brand is it? Is it's it a wolf. wolf? <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. oh, nice. It's a really nice. Oh, oven. that's great. It makes me very happy. It's like the nicest oven, one of the nicest ovens you can get. Oh, that's one so nice though that you have it that. Is. Oh, you're lucky. Oh, I it bet is. your family appreciates that too. It is. I mean, I grew up in, you know, one bedroom apartments with my mother and we did not have very nice kitchens. Rarely did we have a dishwasher, so it's it's pretty great. Yeah, you deserve to give yourself that. Pretty great. Yeah, that's awesome. Chelsea, Chelsea, thanks Chelsea. So I love Virgin River, Mel and Jack are the best on-screen couple I have ever seen. That's oh, right. That's, yeah. Huge, huge Alex fan. Talented and beautiful, thank you. Can you please write so much love to Is there more to that sentence? Uh, can you please write so much love to Chelsea? Okay. Okay, so this is to Lily. There you go, Lily. She survived two cancers in seven years. So congrats for being a survivor. Um, it's amazing. You're also obviously a fighter. Um, you, you said what I'd love to have a picture of talk. I don't have any from that film, I don't think. So, um, but I'll see if I can do that after this session, put it in the shop. Okay. Uh, okay, this is to Peggy. Happy birthday. Gift from my best friend of 44 years. We share a love of Virgin River, among many other things. It has actually brought us closer to long distance. Ah, oh, thank you for making the world a bit brighter. Oh, Peggy, love to you. Well, this is, yeah, this is to your friend, Peggy, right? So to Peggy. Happy birthday. With love, not in. Okay, that's coming to Peggy soon. This pen seems to be getting a little dry. Would that be what are you going to do for, um, for Christmas? You're going to be in New Zealand? Uh, Yes, Christmas, I'll be in New Zealand, the family. Um, and um, what do you guys have? What's your Christmas holiday New Zealand tradition? This is for you, Nancy. Thanks uh, for watching. When I was young, my granddad would do like a roast lamb or roast beef. Mm -hmm. um, my parent, grandparents were all past now, but we often go to my sister's and she usually does a big holes uh, like baked salmon and yeah, that's we'll do nice. A, I love a baked salmon. Yeah, it's kind of simple in a way, but really yummy, and everyone loves it. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is to Sabrina. Oh, Sabrina! Uh, here she is again, folks. Sabrina Volga. Volga. <laughs> I drove to Vancouver from North Carolina to meet you in August. I met Andy and Dave. Oh, you met my mate Dave. Oh, Dave is everywhere. Uh, you did a cameo for me last November. I want to meet you so much. Oh, I'm planning on returning you to Vancouver in Don't September. Don't complete on that one. Just show you me. must meet next September, obviously. Uh, please let me know how I can meet you. Oh, Sabrina. Well, maybe I'll meet you. Photo. You met Andy. Who's Andy? I met Andy and Dave. Andy. Oh. This oh, is the one Andy. for Sonia. That was for somebody else. I think you checked it off. Oh. Uh, so I'm going to go find what out happened? again. 
Don't just uh, oh, do that one. Just on here. I'll fix this one. Uh, At least I made it out to the right person. And I didn't just write it out to the son of Sonia. I'm still there. You know what? The, the fat tip's not doing it for me. It's, oh. it's actually, I can't... I love a fat tip. I can't fit it all in there. Okay. Um, That's why. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so what do your kids do at Christmas? I mean, they just must be beside themselves, right? Just I mean, yeah. Just traditions just... the night before? Do you like... I always, I always do one present. I can open up one present. Oh. Sorry, I'm gonna bring that last one back. I, I had a brain fart. No, no, the, the, like I said okay to the previous one of okay. you, but I didn't write right. Just a second. Okay. Um, so they get one present open the night before. Yeah. And is it usually? That's the next one. That's the cabinet one. Is it? Is it? Um, like a teaser, it's not like the big one, right? It's just something to... I mean, they just get a ton of... My kids get too many presents. I'm just, I think it's... You did Sabrina and now you've got Kathy, right? No, no, I got it. There was the one prior. Oh, one right before that. Yeah, okay. the one that was in the queue. I accidentally marked it complete and it's not. It's a no birthday problem. gift to Catalina. I, I just, I buy them too many gifts, I think, because I'm overcompensating for the childhood that I wanted. <laughs> You know what I mean? I'm sure a lot of parents like, do, that. do that. And vice lot. versa. Yeah. Maybe parents that were spoiled and realized their parents didn't give them any real love. They're like, oh, I don't want to bombard them with presents. Yeah. Instead of maybe, yeah, I'm sure it's hard to find I try balance. to just give them all of the love and the presents. Yeah, well, that was, <laughs> I'm sure I, most kids would want that. Was that 217? What did I just hand you? It would have been 216. Whatever. I, no, Sabrina. Right. Yes. Okay, so right. 217 is what you have, but you marked it as complete. I'm unmarking it, so that should put it back into your queue. Just refresh your page. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry guys, I've lost track here. I'm trying to have a conversation and do all this at the same time. Okay, so if you just refresh that, it should put 217 back. Like there? Yep. And then inside you. There you go. Ah, yes! Mary! Or Marika. Hi Martin, love Virgin River. The story, all of you actors, it calms me down in times with lots of worrying about my three kids. Oof, that's a lot of kids. Some with special needs. Oh, now just battling breast cancer. Holy cow. Oh, also at 43. Can you write something positive? Tia. I think that means thank you. Tia, you saw Belgium. Oh, uh, you know, Marika, I, if you say it that way, I would be delighted. Um, I'm sure breast cancer is quite terrifying. I have a dear friend of mine that went through that a few years ago. and Yes, it was scary, but she did very well. and. With all the right care, I hope that everything works out fine. To Barbara, Kofi forever. <laughs> Kofi. Oh, how do we pronounce this? Musa? Did I say it right? Musa? Musa? Sure. Okay, Mary, there you go. Have faith, stay strong, and don't forget to have fun. Here we go. Fat tip. Yeah, just. My friend, just can't, can't get down with fat tip. Uh, have you got 
Silver. Silver. Just a shout out to our boy Todd here from Streamily. As you may have noticed, none of this would be going anywhere near as smoothly if it was no. just Alex and I on our own. We would be here for three days. Three days. We wouldn't make it to work on Monday. No. no. So thank you, Todd, for all your assistance. You're Streamly, by the way, have been an incredibly amazing company to work with. They've been so quick and professional and made this whole process easy so that we can provide the service to you uh, with no stress in a timely manner. So thank you, Streamly. Okay, this is to Kathy. Kathy, thank you for being a faithful fan. I've got Marissa, who's a nurse, who's watched me be a nurse in two different shows. <laughs> oh, what was the nurse now? Well, I was a nurse on This Is Us. Oh, yeah. Sophie the nurse. Sophie the nurse. Nurse manager. And then Mel Monroe, nurse practitioner. So no wonder you're so life. good at it on Virgin River. You just, you've already been trained to do it. I didn't really do, no. We never saw Sophie. Oh, she we saw her missing. in her scrubs, but we never saw her doing her work. No, there wasn't really enough time in that show. I imagine if I had actually gone back when they asked me to go back as much as I was supposed to, that that would have happened probably at some point. But unfortunately, how interesting though that you've been cast twice in a row as something. Something, something caring something, about me. I think yes, there's something really naturally something about my compassionate face. and sweet. Okay, there we go. Kathy, much love to you. Thank you for being a faithful fan. Heather, I'm just saving a spot for you at Jack's Bar. I guess that's what you want me to write. To Marissa. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Marissa, the nurse. Um, I hope I'm oh. doing my job correctly on the show. We try. We try to be on top of our um, medical uh, techniques. And well, we have techniques. shout out to uh, hmm? y y uh, Yarrow. Yarrow. Y Yarrow. Yeah. We have a wonderful nurse. Is she a nurse in real life? What's her actual? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Who helps us get it all looking like it's the real world. Yeah, we try to keep it correct as much as possible. Um, yeah. Technically accurate. Technically accurate. Okay, this is to this dude's wife, Heather, who said she'll be embarrassed by the attention. Sorry, Heather. Try not to embarrass you too much, but I'm saving a spot for you at Jack's Bar. For Emily and Jess. Hope you guys are having a great day. Hang to a photo watching. This is a new one that just popped in. Oh. You've only got a few left. So. Great. Great for me. This is Rachel. Hi. I love everything you do. You're an inspiration to me and you've changed my life for the better. Really? What did I do? That's for Heather. Can you write a message to me? the hard and bad times, please, from Buffalo, New York. Whoa, how about those Buffalo Bills, though, eh? Doing pretty good. I think they might be the team to beat this year. Though them and uh, Eagles. the Eagles. 8-0 eight, eight of the Eagles. My LA Rams are just disappointing. Guys, oh, I love Virgin River. You guys make it feel so real. Being a nurse, especially the last few years, has been rough. Watching Virgin River has been a beautiful escape. She's a RN, a registered nurse. Thank you, Alana. Yeah, yeah, the last few years has been, oof. especially for our medical friends. Okay, Alana, that's to you. So, 
maybe Alex, you can, um, there we go. Mm -hmm. You can ask some fans some questions. You can have a chat to them. Okay, to Sarah, I'm 47 years old from Adelaide, South Australia. Love you as an actor, would love a great quote. All right, Sarah, Sarah, no worries, mate. This is for Rachel. Rachel, I wrote, um, never give up today because you never know what tomorrow will bring. It's true. That's that's what I live by. That's my little just note, keep my going. My note to self. My note to self. Yeah. <laughs> to I'm gonna write to Sarah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Great name. I wish I knew how to pronounce it. What do you think, Martin? Daikia. Yeah. Or da Daikia. Okay, Sarah, don't sweat the small stuff. And most of it is small stuff. Here you go, love from me to you. Oh. Cecil? Cecile. Cecile. Thank you. Cecile. Oh, I got a, how, what do you think that one is? Cecile's 34th birthday. Oh, uh, happy birthday, Cecile. You want to give a shot at saying that name? <laughs> no, I don't. No. Don't. But thank you for uh, asking. <laughs> Gosh. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm not Caesar? even. Caesar? Maybe it's like Caesar with a. Caesar? With like a female Caesar? 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 Caesar. Caesar. Anyway, to Caesar or Caesar. <clears throat> I have never been live for this long. I don't think I have either. Well, last <laughs> week, last week was rough. I was on my own. Happy birthday, Oof. Cecile! Oh yeah, were you just sort of losing your oh, mind? Oh yeah, no food. Oh, no. <laughs> it was oh you must have been a mess. It, it was. Uh, oh dear. There we go, Caesar. From me to you. Okay, what do we got here? Write this number on the back. Oh, yeah, oh. to Debbie. Okay. See, I don't like those thin tips. I don't like it. Yeah, but if I have to write something. If you need to write something small, then yes, but the, the thicker tip is better because then you can see your name. Yeah, it's I mean, more, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's more pronounced true all right Debbie now the next is Davina I was thrilled I was thrilled to hear that I was thrilled to hear you say that your mum is Scottish I am a very proud Scot ah Davina hmm. uh, I don't know a Scottish greeting but no, I don't um, either. I'm a little bit Scottish um Jeff do you have a little bit of Scottish in you do I gave you a fat tip um, yeah, I've got Scottish, uh, I'm Irish, Scottish, uh, English, Italian, you know, a little French in there. I all have that of, All of Western meat. Europe. Yeah. I, I have the teeniest, tiniest bit of, um, East Asia in there, too, so. East Asian? I don't know. Could mean anything, really. All right, Davina, you lovely Scott, you. Yeah, my mum was born in Edinburgh. My grandmother would always say, Martin, get in the hoose. I'd say, Mom, what's a hoose? What's a hoose? How can I see the rest of these messages if they're, like, not coming up all the way? Well, yeah, they're person... on the bottom. Yeah, it's just that oh, last one. Oh, there it is. Yeah, it trails off a little bit. Oh, I see. On oh, the okay. smaller screen. Yeah. I see. So this woman has been working for teenagers, working with teenagers for 30 years. She's a teacher. 
But they wouldn't be teenagers anymore she's though. Just, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Uh, she says young girls don't have enough positive role models in TV. So oh, but Mel Monroe is strong, yeah. independent, honest, forthright, she compassionate. Is. She's all those things, yes. Dedicated, heartfelt, mm -hmm. attractive woman. She's, she's great. Great lady to portray. Yeah. Oh, nice. Good for young girls to see that. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Tracy. All right, Kata from Hungary. This is for your 40th birthday. Happy birthday to you. Here we go, Kata. Kata. Happy birthday. 40 years young. And 40 years young. Merci à vous. That's right. J'aime beaucoup Martin par sa sensibilité, son charisme. He's really in crunch. Ce gentil, ce bon des autres. Il le sport. Take water. Quel formidable Arthur. I love you, Martin. Oh, Annick, merci. Merci. Oh, that's very sweet. To Annick. Annick, Annick. Feels like a lighting a fire day, huh? Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Jane Wilkins. Okay, Jane Wilkins. Jane Wilkins. What does that name sound familiar? Yeah. Don't know. I don't know oh anything about Jane. Goodness. Are you serious? There you go, Jane Wilkins. Mm -hmm. It's for you. To Sarah from Arizona. Thank you. To. Sarah, hi from Arizona. My favorite look you give Jack. <laughs> this look? <laughs> yeah, that's funny. No. <laughs> Thanks, all of you cast and crew, for taking so much time out of your lives to make this terrific show. Thanks, Kristen. Big up, Sarah from Arizona. Thank you. Now we have Adriana Fernandez. Oh, a special message to a Mexican fan. Uh, let's see. Let's do it. Hola. Mm -hmm. Adriana. This is also the look that I gave to Martin Henderson in real life, too. Like, oh, just hurry up. Just, <laughs> just, just say your line. Just say your line. We don't need to do another <laughs> take, Martin. Martin, it's fine. You're going to do the same thing that you just did in the last one. <laughs> Exactly the same, I promise. Cool. Sometimes it's better. Sometimes. Sometimes. Not always. But you know what? If you got the time, why not take a shot? Yeah. But by, usually by then, I'm just like done with the scene. And I know. You're like, want to move on? Let's do it. We're done. Okay, okay next. <laughs> She's just one and done. And... I just, yeah. Just like, uh, I'm usually actually better on my like third go around. My third take. Third take? And I usually do one or two. Well, take one, you're learning your lines. Take two, you're doing the scene, having learned your lines. And then take three, you're like really jamming. <laughs> no, you know your lines by take one. Sometimes. Sometimes. Well, Adriana. No, um, most of them, I would say enough. Well, we all need a bit more light in this world, that's for sure. 
Here we go, Adriana from Mexico. Muy bien. Okay, Jennifer. Love you watching me on Virgin River. Love you watch. Oh, I love you watching me on Virgin River. My favorite pen. I guess I write all that, yeah? Love you watching me on Virgin River. Yeah, I think that's, you're supposed to say that to, yeah, hi, thank, to Jennifer. Hi, Jennifer. Love you watching me on Virgin River. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Do we have a thin and silver? Um, you know what? This is thinnish. One of mine might be. I'm sorry, I got your brand new one. This one is. This is your last VIP Sunday. Hi, Jennifer. To Leslie. But, you know, I have a bunch more to do anyway, so I'll just... Do you want to just continue on with those while he's signing those to his? Yeah. <laughs> mm hmm Okay. Yeah. I'll probably just do those. Yeah, I'm going to grab those. We'll just keep moving. Hey. Hi, everybody. Still here in our pink matching robes. I just got a message from Gail in my saying apartment. I can't believe you guys are still there. Gail, come entertain us. Come and cook for us, Gail. I wish, I wish Zibby would come over and hang out. Oh, why are you better? Oh my so God. she can watch us sign things? Oh, she can just chat and have a... We'll keep you signing the rest while he finishes. His stream stack, and then we'll, then we'll be done. There you go, Jennifer. Love you watching me on Virgin River. Lots of love to you, Jennifer. Florina, I'm a big fan, but I often get scammed. Oh, Florina, Florina, I'm sorry. Don't fall for that stuff. I would like to have know how to behave, but I'm so happy to have your real autograph. Oh, Florina. Please, everybody, ignore anybody contacting you on Instagram or Facebook or Google Hangouts or Messenger or any social media platform if it's not on this account. I don't have another account. I never will have another account. I, it's not me. It frustrates me so much that people still get fooled by these assholes. Um... This is a message from, this is very sweet. So Leslie, Leslie Gafford um, of Alabama, her motto is Uno Mas. She lost her husband to ALS last year. Oh, and that was our battle cry. One more, one more, one more trip, one more memory, one more day. You're gonna make me oh cry. Oh my goodness. Leslie. Break my heart. Well, we'll just keep going with your list then. Kind of number two there. There you go, Florina. That's for you. Nevada. This is to Tracy from Nevada. Nevada, Nevada, how do you say that? Nevada. And I appreciate uh, the joy you bring to fans like me. Here. Your spirit and positivity reminds me to be grateful for each day I'm given. Oh, Tracy, good. We must be grateful for every day because we don't know how many we've got. I'm pretty sure life beats the alternative. So, you know, make the most of it. Sending you lots of love, Tracy. Bring Zibby over. I wasn't joking. Um, I did. I just texted her. I said hi. Oh. Hi. Uh. Hi. <sighs> okay. To Tracy, much love to you. I got up several times. <laughs> very impressed. I'm very impressed with the how long you can sit there for. What do you mean? Like I've been sitting there the same amount as you. No, I've gotten up several times. I, I went to uh, the bathroom. I've gotten up to get 
get pastries. I'm just trying to get through it. I got. Yeah, it's, it's a lot. Okay. To Marin. This many left to go. No, no instructions. Oh, but I've been a fan since Grays and watched the show off the map. Oh, because you were in it. Oh, thank you, Marin. I loved it. Too bad there were only a few episodes. Yeah, I know. We filmed that in Hawaii. Such a good gig. Uh, I love Virgin River as well. You're awesome. Thank you, Marin. To Marin. Cool name. Much love. And best wishes. Uh, thank you, Marin, for watching off the map in Virgin River. That's to you. Okay, Joanne, I watch Virgin River literally every day, and it is my comfort show. It brings me so much happiness and joy. Love to you. Cute. Uh, and love oh, the show so, so much. Oh, yes, please. To Joanne. Thanks for. You guys are the best fans ever. There you go, Joanne. Be with you shortly. And to Jen. To Jen. Here we go. Oh yeah, she did say she got... There you go. That's for Jen. Wherever you may find yourself, I hope you find yourself happy. Okay, Cindy. Uh, mm -hmm. that. Thanks for the cameo after I was assaulted at work. Oh, I remember that. Oh, I hope you've done all right. I was the manager that had to deal with the crazy stuff. Nothing a few cold plunges didn't cure. Sounds nice. Going to New Zealand, Australia okay. next March. Hope to learn some Maori first hand. Oh. A t shirt? Saw 660 okay. at the Troubadour last month. I saw 660 in 2021 in Wellington at a stadium. It was awesome. Great taste in music, Cindy. There you go, Cindy. I hope you have a fabulous time in New Zealand. And Australia. Don't mean to leave Australia out. Please add, climb your mountain, challenge yourself. You're a precious soul. Your mama must be proud of the human you have become. Oh. All right, Todd, am I writing the entirety of that or just up to precious? Uh, to challenge yourself. Sounds like she wants the whole thing, but it's up to you how much of that you want to put on there, I guess. I'll do it all. Okay. It's it's your sure. yeah. okay. To Melody, here we go, Melody. Hmm. Let the games begin. Melody. Climb your mountain.
There you go. Melody. I hope that's all eligible. <laughs> eligible. This looks rather like a doctor's scrawl, sorry. She said, wait, are you still going? Martin is live still, Jesus pancakes. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus pancakes. That's right, Zibby. Jesus pancakes. That's a bumper sticker. Can you add Mel and Jack? I just did Jody right now. I love stuff for the pages. Can you share your favorite moment? That's more than the twenty special was the proposal scene for you too. Oh, the proposal scene was pretty special. Yeah, it was sweet. Yeah, that was really nice. Yeah, that was pretty. Um. Yeah, we get to do lots of nice scenes together. We set the bar very high for a couple of us, though, I've got to say. <laughs> well, it's, you know, it's nice when you work with people who listen and respond, as opposed to people who just decide what they're going to say and how they're going to say it and stare right through you. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm not going to comment on that, but yes. It is very easy to do a good job with an actress of Alex's ability. <laughs> it's true. No, I'm laughing at oh. She said this is taking 18 business days. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Mal and Jack, a love story for the ages. Okay, hey, Alyssa, Mel and Jack, a love story for the ages. Oh, I had one of those too. Oh, was it from Melissa? It was from Melissa. Oh, there you go. I bet I know which Melissa it is. What do you mean? Well, I don't know. I just, there's a Melissa out there who's a big fan. Oh, I see. You've already had contact it with It might her. be, might be her. I don't know. I'm not sure. That wasn't specified. Ooh, that's your water. Uh, thanks. Okay, I have been a huge fan of you since Off the Map. Wow, a lot of Off the Map fans. That's cool. I didn't realize that many people watched it. Loved you in Grey's, but really love you in Virgin River. It is my all-time favorite show. Can't wait for season five. I was part of the signing last time, and I wanted to do it again. Elizabeth, look at you coming back for seconds. What do you want to do here? I don't, this is a contraption. I don't know. What... Oh. This is what, this, I'm going to show you guys. This is what Martin makes his tea in. Okay, he brings this to work. I shit you not. I, I mean, I don't really know. It's a teapot. What do you mean? You don't really know. It's a it's teapot. Two Elizabeth. I've never seen a teapot like this. Is this normal? I don't know. This is. I, it's beautiful. It's really. It's metal. It's ceramic. It's ceramic? Yeah, yeah. Really? Yeah, it's crazy, right? It's really nice. It's super cool. Um, it almost looks like a pipe. Yeah. Like Andy, I uh, direct the thought of a water bong. Pot. He thought it was a water bong? Yeah. He thought you were getting stoned at work? Yeah. I love that. That's great. <laughs> there you go, Elizabeth. Thanks for watching. Look at all his, yeah. his teas. He brings his teas. I, I bought so much tea from these people that they actually gave me that, um, pot for free last time I went in. <laughs> you know you spend way too much money in the store when they start just giving you, giving you stuff. For yeah, time. well, that's nice. Yeah, that's a nice photo. Yeah, you should get some. You should do a photo shoot. I haven't done a photo shoot in so many years. That's why I did one. And yeah. you know what? I'll tell you. Tell me. It was, it was paid for. By the photographer. Oh, you're kidding? No. Oh. I need to get on I that. had to. I had to pay for um, hair and makeup um, because they gave a certain amount, and that's what the right. And you paid. Right, right. That's fine. But you wouldn't need all. Um, 
Uh, they do it. They do it. Yeah. You could get one person to do it. The things that we talked about. No, I should totally do. I haven't done headshots in over ten years. Exactly. Yes, I will do that when I find a minute. Okay, to Elizabeth. No, I did Elizabeth. Next is Laura. Hi, Martin from Northern Virginia, right outside of DC. Thank you for providing us viewers with amazing entertainment. You're a gem of an actor. Can you write for me one of your favorite Jack Shooting quotes? Thanks so much. Laura. Yes, Laura, of course I can. To Laura. Uh... For me, Virgin River, best show ever. Linny in Arizona, uh, a fellow Commonwealther, happy Guy Fawkes Day. Do you guys don't even know what that is, do you? What? Mm -hmm. Oh, Fox you do? Yeah. Oh, you do? Guy Fawkes was this dude in, oh, okay, yeah. in, in England back in the day, and he tried to blow up Parliament with that was real? gunpowder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I put water in this? Yeah, and so every 5th of November, um, New Zealand, Australia, England, maybe Canada, I don't know, uh, let off fireworks to celebrate this dude that tried to blow up Parliament, which I think is pretty cool. Wow, it's you blow it up all the way? Yeah. And then stir? Uh, no, I just let it sit. Okay. Thank you. Do you want a mug with it? Oh no no yeah cup two men with best wishes. There we go, Lynn from Arizona. Happy guy, folks. And now Markel. It's a cool name too. Two. Oh, thank you. Here we go, Markel. To you. To Angel. <laughs> She's putting tattoos on that, so funny. Who is Tibby? Tibby. Hi Angel! They're real cute, but 
Vegas. Sort of stopped being cute after noon. <laughs> <laughs> We're moving into early evening hour. It's time for a costume change. Vicky, Maybe your biggest followers in but Texas. I'm worried about your blood sugars, especially you, Martin. Do we need to fly you in some food? <laughs> a little DoorDash action? Tell me what I gotta do. So how can you wrap this up? Vicky, come and sign for me! Vicky, your biggest follower in Texas. Okay, Vicky. Almost done. It says I have 63 left. <laughs> That's including the offline duels. Oh, yeah. We need to get him through his stack and then we'll be done with the stream. Right, right, right. right, right, right. Um, get you through your stack. Girl. Listen. I, I've been hand feeding Mark food. It's true. And uh, tea. I've moved on to a glass of rose <laughs> because it is that time. We um, figured by this point we might as well just stay in our robes and. <laughs> get <ready> and, uh, <laughs> getting dressed seems pointless. Pointless and just not necessary. Seems like a waste of time to get dressed actually at this point. Um, those tattoos look really good on you, by the way. Like, she wants to get a whole sleep. I know you want to get to sleep, but I actually really like those birds. Just like, like that much. But I do have to warn you that um, it hasn't been recording the entire time. Oh no. <laughs> I just. Okay, Jill. I just that's made you. A whole recording. Thank you, Jill. A whole recording. From Louisiana. And it didn't record. That was so lame. You were saying made the trip a couple of times, but I couldn't I run saying, into you. Oh, Gary. I've been feeding Martin, but he brought extra food, which is good. And um, we're not gonna get dressed anytime soon. Uh, when are you gonna be done with all your business? Um, what time? What time am I seeing you today? <laughs> Let's get that rolling. After this, I'm almost done with this. Carrie, that's you. Carrie from what's the A again? Virginia. Virginia. There you go. Lovely to meet you up here. Okay, Nancy. I leave it to you to write something. Thanks, Nancy Coddington, in Middleton, Delaware. <clears throat> okay, to Nancy. in Delaware. And this one is for Monica. Happy birthday, Monica. Happy birthday, Monica. Wishes. There you go, Monica. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Monica. Yeah. I have yeah. a chicken named Monica. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, this is to Tina. Aw, Tina. Okay, thank you, Tina. Sending you lots of love. For myself. How many eggs do you get a day? Here you go, Tina. A lot in, this, love. A lot in the um, summer months. But we, you know, we started with 12 chickens and now we only have four. And we, so we only have three laying hens and a rooster. <clears throat> and we need to get more chickens. Um, especially because the winter months are coming and I need them to have, you know, they all roost together and they need the warmth. I mean, I have heaters in there and stuff. And like, if it gets really cold, I'll tarp around the outside of their coop and the heaters will be going, so they'll be fine. And a lot of people say, don't heat your chicken coop because- Don't heat your coop. Don't heat your coop because they're like, well, they're chickens and they should just be hardy on their own, but- Right. I'm a mom, as you can see. Go. Lots of love to you. Happy birthday, Lisa. Happy 50th. 50's the new 35. Okay, next we have Caroline. Hi, Martin Greens from Milford, Pennsylvania. I'm a big fan and love the show. Just wanted to say thank you for bringing warmth and kindness and love through to your audience and fans. Oh, hoping for many more seasons of Virgin River. Caroline, we hope we're going to make this for you for many, many years. We'll see what Uncle Ted Sarandos decides to do with the show. But for now, we are very grateful that you are enjoying it as much as you do. Okay, there you go, Caroline. I need to take a shower too. From Pennsylvania, from Milford, Pennsylvania. There's a Milford in New Zealand where I grew up. Okay, this is Susan. St. Louis, Missouri. My mom's 85th birthday is November 21st. Oh, she is an incredible mother to 12 children. Can you imagine? No. Oh. Nope. <laughs> Shut it down. That's amazing. Wow. I'm impressed. Wow. Very impressed. Wow. I can't, I can't have 12 children. They'd eat me alive. Oh, I'm going to give her a birthday wish. Thank you. This would mean the world to her. Okay, so this is, I guess this is to your mom, Susan. I hope it is. To Susan. To Must her be. mother, Susan, probably. Yeah, well, she doesn't have her name. Hopefully she pulled it out, right? Okay. All right, let's try it. <laughs> let's hope. Let us be hoping. Dear Susan. Uh, happy 85th. You legend. Love and best wishes. Oh, I got a Herman. Great name, Herman. You should have put a bingo card together before this. A what? You should have put a bingo card together before this. Yeah. Here we go. Cool Happy singing. birthday to Susan, turning 85 on November 21st. Well done, Susan. Last time you wanted to know where people were from. I'm from South California, Southern California. This is Marissa from Orange County. Okay, will you speak in Jack's voice? Uh, I don't know what that. Uh... Jack's voice? Oh, well, I guess you want me to do an American accent, Marissa? Does that sound about right? You do it all day, every day. No, she says, she says, I love your accent, but signing my photo while you're when you speak in Jack's voice. Just, just okay, Marissa. I'll do my best. Marissa. From Orange County. This is not, this is not a VMP. I'm going to say it anyway, though. Uh, my 13-year-old daughter, Nora, watched... Every season of Virgin River four times. Wow. She loves you and Martin. I can't figure out. She's 13? How to buy a picture of both of you. So oh, she must have jumped on. She's after the show. Yeah. yeah. But you both, but if you both signed this, I would be so grateful. Marissa, there you go. That's from me to you. 
Happy Saturday in Southern California. I bet you it's nice and warm down there. Okay. Deborah or Dan. Oh, Debbie, congrats on your role in Luja River. Totally obsessed about it. Every day I watch. Wow, it looks worse as a therapy for me. Do you have anything in common with Jack? Um, what do you have in common with Jack? Uh, well, I think I'm romantic, but I'm not sure if I'm as romantic as Jack. What's the most romantic thing you've done? Shelly, count your blessings. Wise words, Shelly. Ooh, to October. Well, that's a cool name. Mm, that's a cool name. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is to Wendy Meadows.
Too windy meadows or just too windy? Either way. Is it too windy? Is it more Peerless personal? choice. Here you go, Wendy. To you. Try to measure up, but she sets the bar a little high for me. Thanks for doing this for your fans. Oh. Did I do Anna? You just did Anna. This yes. is this is Beatrice. Uh, Beatrice, thank you, Martin, for all of you give you our son. Oh, S U N. Beatrice, fifty four from Paris, France. I now know how to cook bread. Yes, granola and pavlova. Beatrice, this is so good. So nice to share some. I taught you to the bread. The you bread. Did. So, so you have turn. this one to thank Beatrice for that and bread. You taught me how to make pavlova. Oh yeah. Did you ever do the the granola? I didn't, but oh, I so want good. to. It's so good. You have to give. Me, did you give me the recipe for it? I thought I did. I don't know. I can, I can find it. It's so good. It's kind of easy. And I've looked at recipes online. Yeah, I know, but this is. The shit. Uh, to Beatrice. Uh, we'll be soon. Okay, these last two are just signatures. Okay, Beatrice, there you go. No personalization, no uh, special instructions. Seventy-one years That's, old. Okay. Sorry, seventy-one years young, mm -hmm. and I love to dance like nobody's watching. Mm. Until we get to the rest of the stuff. <laughs> Until we go to Dead Wars. Mm -hmm. If you need a break, now's the time to take it. Thank you. We'll get through his thing in the stream Today. and then we'll take a break and then get into the rest of the stuff. It shouldn't take that much longer. Oh. Tomorrow is not promised. I like the way you think, Gail Alder. Live for today, for tomorrow is not promised. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Nice, Gail. I hope I'm dancing like no one's watching it from 71. Thank you, Gail. Much love to you. Okay, Ingergred. Ing Ingerd. Ingergird. 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 It's a gift from a fellow Twitter member fan. Is it a gift from? Yeah, so somebody got it from her. Okay. Two. Oh, yeah. Ingergird. There you go, Ingergird. Well, I guess it's for the person who's getting it for Ingergird. There you go. Coming to her soon. I'm going to be drunk by the time we're done. But what's this here? That's our duos. Oh, good lord. Yeah. Yeah, you have 16. But more. we're not doing this today, are we? Yeah, the we are. We are. You won't need, I mean, yeah. I mean, I can come back tomorrow, but I'm only no, up here for the weekend. Oh, okay. Uh, Dikia. You did this one before, right? Dikia? Dikia? 
Yeah. Top of that stack, those are just signatures only for later. Do you want to start working on those? That, yeah. that stack right there, those two different prints. This one? That one and the stuff below it, but. Are you good? Oh, okay. Yeah. So I can just do these. Um, and, and the other one because Martin's already signed those. Oh, oh gotcha. Yep. So all of them. I do that. Oh, yes. Here's someone from Ohio. Uh, Ohio Natives, the National. My favorite band. It's a must that we be Spotify friends. Ha ha. Oh, Mackenzie. Right on Mackenzie. Just here in my jammies. <laughs> Hanging out in my jammies. <laughs> 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 They're in your pajamas. <laughs> oh dear. There we go. Let's go to you, Mackenzie. Go to the national. Yes. Okay, Diane, what are you doing back there? <laughs> Trying again since the audio went out when you signed the last time. Oh, and I didn't hear a word you said. Oh, Diane, I'm so sorry. Do you have any idea of the impact you have made? Oh. oh, you're so sweet, Diane. Thank you very much. Excuse this one. <laughs> Come on, that was funny. For a little comic relief. Oh, that's nice. To Diane. <laughs> it's, I'm uh, not drunk yet, by the way. It's, this is just how I am. Yep. It's pretty normal. Yep. Normal for me. Best wishes. Get a little punchy. <laughs> you would get punchy too if you were signing autographs for three hours. Three and a half hours. Okay, Diane, there you go. Sorry about the audio on the last one. I hope this got to you loud and clear. Okay, this is to Laura. This is a surprise gift and I do not have her shipping address in the Netherlands yet. Okay, the billing name and address are in my name, okay. Got it, so this is going to Sharon. Sharon Noll. May I contact you after signing with her address? Yeah, that's, you guys that's, can do that's, that. That's for streamer, she can contact. Yeah, you guys will uh, be able to enter in the shipping address, Sharon, um, on Streamly, so, because these all these prints are gonna go back to the Streamily office, and then from there they'll go out to wherever you want them. So if you make sure they have the correct shipping address, they'll get to Laura. So that's to Laura. So this yeah. is to Laura. Oh, what a nice friend you are, Laura. Give this gift. I mean, Sharon, for your friend Laura. There we go. Lots of love to Laura. Maggie Gertner, Gartner, Gertner, I'm not sure, but uh, uh, thank you for taking the time to do these signings. It means a lot to all the Virgin River fans. Oh, guys, it means a lot. You guys care so much about the show, so thank you to Maggie. Okay. Best. Wishes to Maggie. Love. Martin. There we go. Going to you, Maggie Gutner. And now Maria. Oh! Bahan fan, all the way from Barbados. Wow, okay. Maria. Bahan fan. That's my favorite. Bahan fan. All the way in Barbados. Am I supposed to write all of that? Sending lots of love to my favorite Bahan. I would just say sending lots of love to my favorite Bahan fan. Okay. So Maria. Oh. 
lots of love to my favorite. I feel like my posture is just crunching down as we are the hours go on. Favorite. Another Libra. Oh, I love you. So this is a present to myself. Oh, that's nice. Virgil has really become a go-to comfort show this year. Hope it continues for many more seasons. Love to you and Alex. Oh, say thanks, Leah. Thanks, Leah. <laughs> thanks, Leah. Woo! To Leah. You, <laughs> you, oh shoot, here we go, you gorgeous Libra, you, Leah, thank you, okay, D. Oh my goodness, D is on her fourth run of Virgin River. D. Oh dear. Uh, adore the show, love all the way from Ireland. This is a birthday present to me. Oh, give me that last one. I think that was a birthday present to herself. Wasn't it? For Leah? Yeah. Uh, I would have to go back and look again. Yeah, it was. I think it was. Oh, okay. Let me, let me quickly double check. Them. Yeah, okay. Oh. Okay. That one, I'll, I'll do D, yep. Oh, this is a birthday present to D. Oh, I quite love it when people spoil themselves. Mm -hmm. Happy birthday, D. Do you approve of all the shopping in? Yeah, I wish I was a bit better at it. Myself, you know, like. So I respect it when people do that. There you go, D. Happy birthday, love. This was a birthday present to herself. Yes. Oh, good. Okay. To Leah, you gorgeous, leave her love. That was D you just did. Yep. Okay, I'll check that one off. There we go, there we go. So now we're doing Amy. Just a quick note to say, hi, Martin from Sheffield in the UK. I hope you're well and can't wait for season five. Thank you, Amy from Sheffield in the UK. To Amy. With love. Wow, it's probably really late over there in the UK. If you're still watching, Amy, sending you love, sweet dreams. Thanks for watching. Okay, Betty Brown, Betty Brown from North Carolina. Thanks to the crew of Virgin River. Oh, love to Mel and Jack. Betty Brown. Oh, that's a sweet name. To Betty Brown. Love these ones. There you go, Betty Brown. That's for you. In North Carolina. Is that the Panthers? Carolina Panthers. Carolina Panthers. Good luck with the NFL. Betty Brown probably doesn't give a toss about the Panthers, but who knows. Okay, Joanne. Hi again, this is my third. Oh, Joanne, you greedy little thing. You know what? You can't have too much of a good thing, can you? All right, Joanne. You're going to be a collector of these. <clears throat> there you go, Joanne, with two ends. Much love to you. 
Shirley. Don't call me Shirley. This is for my mother, Shirley, if possible, a belated happy 86th birthday to wish to her. Oh, Shirley, absolutely that's possible. Happy birthday, Shirley. Suzanne Hybertson. Okay, I'll just do your first name, I think. Two. Suzanne with two M's. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Five yeah. more to go. Here we go, Suzanne. That's for you, Hybertson. And Andalucci. Netherlands, as you always say. All right, lots of love, Martin. All right, all right. Do I always say that? How else do I say that a lot? What do you say? All right, all right. Maybe I do. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. That's not something that stands out in my mind. No, maybe I don't know myself as well as I thought I did. I Two. You, well, you don't. You know why? You're because you're saying it with an accent, and most of the time. That we talk, you're, you know. All right, all right. Oh, maybe that's an American thing. All right, all right. All right. You have to put a Southern tone to it. You got all McConaughey, is it right? All right, 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 all right. All right, all right, all right. I get older and they stay the they same, same, same age. age. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Good line of dialogue that one. Andalucci. All right, all right, all right. All right, I'm gonna say that. Uh, all right, that's a love. All right. Let's love. Here you go, Andalucci. I feel like my pen might be suffering, right? It seems to be. Okay. I'll take the one you just. Let's discard that. that one. Judy, if we don't love ourselves, we can never truly love someone else. Oh, please fix if I miss a part. Love your work, Judy. Or, so you can never truly accept love from anyone else. Right. Mm. Yep. To Judy. I'm really glad I drove that home into myself when I was in my 20s. It was a good idea. Yes. <laughs> Very important. Yeah, if we don't love ourselves, we can never truly love someone else. So if you're thinking about getting involved with someone and you notice that they don't love themselves, run. <laughs> what, if you're, what if you're married to somebody that's like that? What do you do? If you're already married to them? Yeah. Uh, just. I know people that are married then, to people Then that you are just, not... you gotta learn to love yourself, right? And. No, but what if you do and you're married to somebody that doesn't love themselves, right? Oh, personally, I. If it wasn't a happy marriage, I'd, I'd bail, yeah. Right. Well, I think that's what happens a lot of times. Yeah, life's too short to not enjoy it. Okay, there we go. Judy, lots of love to you. All right, Mickey, I'm hanging this above my mid-century bar. I'm home. It will be the perfect touch of class and conversation. Ooh, I like your style, Mickey. Thank you, my Anne. Also, what is your signature drink if you have one? I'd have to say I enjoy a Moscow Mule or North Pole Mule. Cheers, Mickey. Ooh, you like a drink with a kick, huh? Ooh, a signature drink. You know, I like anything with yuzu in it. 
any anything with yuzu. Yuzu is my favorite citrus of all, and I just love that flavor. So they have they have a really nice sparkling yuzu drink uh, at Whole Foods. Here. Uh -huh. Oh wow. Okay. It's like it. It's in there. It's just up the street. And it's not high sugar. As long as it's not like, so, yeah, I you love can yuzu. Put it on ice. It's a Japanese citrus. Oh, that's oh, okay. so Sorry, nice. I, I, I'm, it's lemon. I'm thinking of yeah. the, Greek, the Greek liqueur that tastes like black licorice. Oh, yuzu. Uh, yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. No, 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 that's lemon. a whole that, other that's thing. That's yuzu. That, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just a, yeah, it's just a lemon. A kind of lemon. Right. Yes. It's like lemon. It's just Similar to a lemon, but it's kind of got a bit of orangey in it, it too. Like, um, it, yeah, it's just, or, or it's kind of herbaceous, I think yeah. I would say. Yeah, yeah. I love it. Yeah. Gosh, look at all those sales on there right now. I know. Right. Two, um, two Mickey. Oh, Mickey, you're so fine, you're so fine, you blow my mind. Hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. It's two. Fast we could clap. Yeah, we definitely need to clap. Two Mickey. Um. Oh, so Mickey's got a bar. I see it. Drink is a Moscow Mule. Ooh. I'm gonna write. Have a drink on me. You yeah, haven't really had Jack making too many drinks. Well, maybe. No. Here you go, Mickey. Enjoy the bar, mate. Oh, man. Are you ever working the bar now? I've done some admin-y stuff in the office, and but not really, because Hannah's working the floor a lot. Uh -huh. Preach is there in the kitchen and partnering up, so yeah. Partnering up. Yeah. Happiness always. Oh, to Karen. I like that. Happy. Happiness. Happiness. Stop it. <laughs> it's a good thing we're right at the end. Happiness. Always. Oh, dear. Almost made it. We're, we're fine. I'm just quoting here. Okay, here we go. Here you go, Karen. Happiness to you. Always. This is the final autograph of the live stream. Oh, come on! The final autograph of the live stream goes to none other than the hardest name that I've had to say today, of course. Leia Vanisha. Leia Vanisha. Sounds good this to me. This photo is for a young lady who works with me. It's a surprise for her, all of her hard work. Oh, it's from Gail Alder. Oh, good on you, Gail. What a sweetheart. Okay, I will make sure I spell this name correctly. To R A Y E V A N E I S H A. Okay, two over here. This. This is. Okay, there we go, Gail. That's for Raven Yesha, if I'm saying her name right. And that, that today. brings us to the end of today's live signing. Oh, care of myself and my other pajama clad friend, Albert Brugerich! I can't do that. Yeah! Bye. Bye, folks. Thanks for joining. Join us next time. Have a blessed weekend. See ya. See ya.